conflict between uh, the black community uh, and uh, the immigrant community. On Tuesday night, Democracy Now!'s Messiah Rhodes caught up with Forget Blow, a pro-Trump rapper who debuted his video, Trump, Trump Baby, featuring Amber Rose at the RNC um, a day after she spoke. Well, this is what he said to Messiah. I've been supporting Trump like die hard since 2015. Um, before that, I was with Rick Ross, uh, French Montana, a lot of big name rappers, had a lot of big name songs. So I was already very successful in that side of the industry, you know, grinding my way in. Um, but Donald Trump was like the boss, you know what I mean? He's getting money, he's a rapper's dream, you know? He's out here now dodging bullets, getting indictments, he's a real rapper. But, you know, back in 2016, when he came in, it was just about proving people wrong. And that's one thing I'm big on. Nobody believed that he would be the president. He knocked that door down, right? Um, he's very successful, he's made a lot of money, he's got got the beautiful wife, nice cars. So it's just, you know, being young, trying to chase that dream and be like Trump, you know what I'm saying, and just have a positive role model to look up to. And even though at one time we didn't see eye to eye, I could bring you in. Amber Rose, she spoke yesterday. She's a model. She was big against Trump for years. I have a new video that just came out with her, a song called Trump, Trump Baby. She's on the song. It's number eight, number uh, eight on Billboard right now. Um, but the thing is, a lot of people don't realize, like, we need new voters. Right. So when we these people like, you know, we're out here making all this content for Donald Trump and, you know, trying to sell Donald Trump on people and they're not buying it. And then when they finally buy it five years later and we're like, boo, you can't do it. That hurts us. We need to get the new voters. We need new voters. We need to get people equal opportunity. Soon after they spoke, rapper Forgiato Blow and Amber Rose took the stage of the RNC. Hey, yeah, it's the mayor of Magaville, baby. Amber Rose. You know who we voting for? We voting Donald Trump, baby. America needs safe. America needs safe. We voting Trump, Trump, baby. November 5th, we going crazy. November 5th, we going crazy. Red pill pop is swerving in the That's right for Forget a Blow and Amber Rose, Trump, Trump, baby. Um, Professor Clarence Lusain. Yep. <clears throat> You are exactly right. America needs saving from you. First of all, I didn't even know who you were. I did not even know you existed until I saw this little piece right here. Then you made a song with Amber Rose. I, I don't even know what Amber Rose claim the fame is. I don't, what, what's her talent? And then when he said, oh, she's a model. All right. There's a lot of different models that I know. Her? Never did didn't even know didn't know she was a model. Only thing I knew about Amber Rose is that she was attached to the arm of Kanye West at one point. Then on top of that, on top of that, this man said that Donald Trump is every rapper's dream. What? And that that that's why rappers like him. Okay, I'm a rapper. I'm also a poet. You didn't know it, but now you do. So here's my thing. <clears throat> I'm not mad. I'm not upset. I'm confused. I'm confused. You're saying that you want to get the word out there about him. Now, you're not the first one that did this. I remember before, <clears throat> there were some rappers that were rapping, saying people, telling people to go and vote, and they were doing it for, for Democrats. I didn't like that either. And, and, and it was the rappers that were presenting... The, the songs themselves. I, I was like, no, no. And they were like all in the strip club and stuff like that. No, no, no. And I'm going to be honest with you. There's a lot of rappers I don't even allow my son to listen to. I don't. I don't allow my son to listen to certain rappers. And this guy, I won't let him listen to him, not because of his context, but because he sucks. He's not a good artist. There's nothing, there's nothing good. Dude, I listen to your song. You're not even original. Trump, Trump, baby, we're voting Donald Trump, baby. You mean like Ice, Ice, baby, that song that came out? Like, what are you talking about? There's nothing original about you. There's nothing clever about you. There's nothing. You, you don't, you, you're a talentless hack. You don't have talent. You don't. I'm now, I'm going to go back and I'm going to go and figure out what songs you put out with these other artists that you talked about. But no, no, this ain't it. This ain't it. Live up to the dream. What dream? What dream? And then what? Excuse me. What? What? What rappers are out that you's like? Oh, oh, they look up to him. What? What? What rappers are these? 
What are you talking about? Hmm? And then you talk about his wife. Okay. Okay, okay. Kendrick Lamar. Kendrick Lamar has a beautiful wife, beautiful, beautiful family. Lyrically, and the art that he puts out there, not like yours, okay? But the art and stuff that he puts out there. I never once heard him say anything to talk about Donald Trump. Matter of fact, Kendrick Lamar don't even talk about money like that. <clears throat> what about DMX? What about Nas? What about, okay, I'm not going to say Jay-Z. I'm not, I don't even like Jay-Z. But there's other rappers and stuff that are out there that are not bringing up or talking about stuff like that. His indictments and stuff. How does that, oh, oh, so now that makes him a part of the hip-hop culture because of his indictments? Man, get out of here. Look, I'm just going to put this real simply. You are a talentless hack. Donald Trump <laughs> has no talent either <laughs> at all. Like, what, what are, we, are you doing? Like, so you, you're voting for him because of his of his failures, of the things that put him in the position because he kept making bad decisions. Not only did he keep making bad decisions, the decisions that he made were actually decisions that were actually harming other people. And since that happened, then you're like, oh, okay, cool. Yeah, man, that's that's a rapper's dream. You you don't make sense. Okay. Policies. What did he do when he was in when he was president for four years? Are there policies that you agree with that you liked and thought that hey, you know, these things have help and contribute to the nation? But no. He's a rapper's dream because of his wife. Who he married. This is his second marriage, isn't it? Like, what are you? What are you talking about? As a matter of fact, didn't he cheat on his wife? Like, what are you? What are you talking about? Like, you're not making. You're not making any sense. None whatsoever. Oh my god. That's just. I'm not even gonna close the video. Y'all just go. Y'all get out of here.